So I got a question the other day. Client says, hey Will, after my refeeds or after my diet breaks, I sweat a lot more. Why is this? Easy answer, coming up next. Hey everybody, what's going on? Coach William Grazion here, and in today's video, we're talking about thermogenesis. So I got a question the other day from one of my clients and she noticed that her body temperature or her ability to sweat was actually increased after her high carb days. And she's like, why am I sweating more? I've never been a sweater, but I'm sweating now. Let's think about this. What does thermogenesis mean? What does thermic mean? It means the creation of heat. Thermogenesis is the creation of heat. Now, if you think about this, the more calories you put into your body, the more thermogenic or the more thermodynamic you actually are. So if you're feeding yourself a huge meal, your body requires so much energy to be able to break down those carbs, those fats, those proteins, to be able to shuttle those throughout your body and get them where they need to go. That energy demand makes your body work harder. So in theory, thinking about it, if you were to have higher calories, it would increase thermodynamics and that would essentially increase your body temperature. So for an example, if you're having a big pre-workout meal, you go into the gym and you're sweating like a moose, but then maybe your low carb days come and you're on day four or five of your low carb days, you eat a pre-workout meal with very few carbohydrates in it, do you think you're gonna sweat as much in the gym? Maybe, maybe not. Sweating is also directly correlated to your thyroid. So as an example, if your calories have been too low for too long, keep in mind that your thyroid is essentially down-regulated, right? Because leptin is sending a signal to your pituitary gland, which is then sending a signal to your thyroid telling you to preserve energy because calories have been restricted for maybe four or five days or more. Keep in mind that it only takes about four to five days of having reduced calories for your uh, leptin serum to actually drop by as much as 40 to 50%. So, if you ever wonder why you're hotter after a refeed day or after a high carb day, this is why it's called thermogenesis, the creation of heat. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.